Welcome back to DP Gaming. Uh, I'm Dill. I'm Phil. And we're here with Plantain Guy. Uh, we're playing Twilight Princess and we're just carrying on from where we left off last time. So, we're just on our way to go and light a big spider's web on fire, I think. Yeah, I think pretty much. Because last time we, uh, keep on getting disoriented by the fact that it's not, <laughs> it's mirrored from the Wii version. Yeah. Oh, and this guy's still dead. That's nice. Yeah, well, I mean, to be fair, we haven't left the area, so I guess that's, that's the only reason they respawn, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, in this deep, dark cave, which apparently is filled with, filled with danger. Although, so far, we've literally only seen a small plant guy. Well, you know, if you don't have your wooden sword... I, I suppose, yeah. And these keys. I never knew they were called keys until recently. No? Little weird bat things. Don't understand why they just call them bats. Ah, oh, but calling them keys makes them mythical. Ooh, mythical bats. <laughs> that can go on fire, like, I don't know, fire bats. <laughs> like some kind of magical fire bats. Yeah. <laughs> You are really frugal with that, Lantern. Yeah, it's because I don't... Do you know what Places later in the game where you do need it. Yeah. You get free refills, essentially. You get them in the grass or something, don't you? Yeah. Or you get them outside the... Sand Temple, I think it is, as well. There's, like, just a big pot. Okay. Also, you can steal it from the parrot uh, later down this trap. I mean, you're supposed to pay for it, but you can't just run away. Oh. It's just if you come back, he'll chase you and, like, peck you. Oh, okay. So, you literally, it's a one-time steal. Yeah. Okay. Or you can just pay for it. But who wants to do that? Stealing is fun. Yes. Don't, don't, don't steal, kids. It's not good. Uh. Are we doing Attenborough for rupees? Because <laughs> we might be doing it a lot. That's <laughs> nah, Brian Blesser for rupees. You got a yellow rupee! <laughs> nice. <laughs> Just, just you know, little, little, little ones, because I can't do that voice for very long. <laughs> uh, I saw a little rat here. Is that got, they got the rat's got a weird little name as well. It probably all does. Yeah, they're called like uh, uh, yeah, yabbies. Oh, rupees, Oof. rupees for days. Oh, Phil, are you? Oh no, I was going to ask whether you're going to the Olympics, but I don't, don't think so. with shooting. No. Nah. I mean. Oh, and they're all disappearing before I even get to them anyway. Ah. That one, though. Oh. Ah. You got a blue ruby! Yeah, because I think the main thing I meant was that this game, every time you like restart from a session, um, it will do the rupees again. It will do, like, five rupee and above. It will do it as, like, a new flag. Oh, okay. I know that can get quite annoying as it goes on. That's so it, you might get bored of doing the Brian Blatter voice. I might get bored of it. Uh, please forgive me if I do. What are those red things there? I think those are where we need to be going. Okay. Uh, oh, let's go... Something. Oh, first real enemy that can actually do some damage to us. Smack. 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 Die. God, the combat is exhilarating. You dealt with him <laughs> like some sort of pro there. Where are we going to go first? Are we going to go to the one on the left or the one on the right? I believe the one up here on the right is a... You can get a piece of heart. Oh, I okay. Think. Well, we got to collect them. Yeah, well, we're, we're obviously 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, just a disclaimer there, we're not 100%ing in any way, <laughs> shape or form. Uh, because ain't nobody got time for that. Uh, we'll do a decent job. <laughs> yeah. We're not just going to walk past everything, but... Uh, there is no way we're collecting all of those golden bugs. <laughs> <laughs> Screw the golden bugs. No, it's uh, posing this, isn't it? Uh, I thought there's that little girl who collects you collect bugs. For oh them. shit! Yeah, there is bugs as well. Yeah. And you've got the uh, the pose which turned the golden man back to normal. See, there's so many collectibles in this game. Uh, <laughs> Gotta catch them all. I think, I think I started trying to do a 100% smack, years ago. Smack, smack, smack. There we go. <laughs> it's the full smack method. Yeah. I started trying to do one a, a few years ago, well, a few years ago, like probably seven or eight years ago, um, and I I stopped almost immediately. I, I just played through the game because I just wasn't having fun with it at that point. What was it? A bit laborious, 100%. It's, it was just, yeah, laborious. I mean, you could, I suppose, just like finish most of the game and then come back and do all the collectibles, but then you're just running through everything again. <laughs> you got a small key. This key opens the gate to Faron Woods. Okay, so we've got the gate now. And also, whatever's in here. Oh, what's this? Could it, could it be? It, it, it is! 
You got a piece of heart. Collect five pieces to form a new heart container and increase your life energy. Is this the first one where they change it from four to five as well? Yes. Uh, uh, I'm not sure how many others actually are five. Because I think Wind Waker and earlier are all four. The, from what I remember, yeah. yeah. And I know Skyward Sword. I'm pretty sure Skyward Sword is four as well. Hmm. Um, so I don't know, yeah. Skyward Sword. Skyward Sword is a game. Smack, 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 smack. And you got the, you got a, a key as well. Ah, mate. Not not a key, but a key. You know, get on me. You know, Skyward Sword is a game I tried to complete. I really did. Uh, but I don't know. It's just it just it just didn't didn't resonate with me as much as like especially Ocarina of Time, which is my personal favourite game, and then my favourite game at least of the this franchise, and then uh, Majora's Mask as well. Stabby stabby. Stabby stab. What are yours? What, what do you what, what do you like? What favorite games where, in yeah. the series? Where are your, Where do you rank yours? Um. See, I think Ocarina of Time is still number one, but I'm not sure if that's more nostalgia nowadays than that. Because, but then again, whenever I play it, it's still like I still enjoy it. Like I still enjoy the story beats. I still enjoy doing all the kind of yeah stuff again and the cutscenes and all that and the temples are all well designed. But that's, I mean, um, that's it. I, I see, hear a lot of people who complain like you've got to wait for enemies too long, but I don't know. I refuse to, to believe that it's because of nostalgia that I think it's one of my favourite games. Yeah. I'm certain that it's because I just I just love the game so much. How are you going to deal with these two with the same... I and he just takes take an extra, extra stab. stab. Yeah, because he didn't get hit by the first one. Okay. But it's the four stab, it's the four slice method. It's just you press the B button four times and they die. Yeah. Patented, of course. Uh, Forest Temple ahead. Forest Temple ahead. Got enough lantern oil? If not, stop at Trills. I don't know why David Atten is doing an advertisement there. I oh, know he's he's down on his down on his luck. Recently. Yeah, this is this is this stab, is early Atten. Stab, stab, stab. There we go. You love you some stabbing. Yep. It's a, it's a full stab. Has anyone ever? Like when a when a pe when a heart's dropped, regardless of whether or not you've got full hearts, I always always go and pick it up. Yeah, unless it's falling off an edge. Although your hook shot can pick up items. Yeah. Uh, later in the game, ah. so I'm not sometimes I'm like, oh, I wonder if I'll be able to catch it. Ah. But that's more of just a skill thing. Stab, 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 stab. And Extra yeah. stab, stab. There are quite a, there's quite a few items in this game which I'm just remembering about now, like the future ones, and they make me very excited. They make me very <laughs> excited because I forget, I forget about so many aspects of this game. It's like such an in-depth one. Hmm. A lot of them, because it's got because it's got the stages. Obviously, it's got the Twilight Zone and it's got the uh, it's got the, obviously the normal one. Yeah. It's a bit it's a bit like somewhere some weird crossover between. Oh wow. Do you want to do this voice? Woo! Hey! Woo! You're super! God. <laughs> now just buy something! Hey! Bit pushy. You know, well, this is the person we can rob, so... <laughs> if we wanted, we could go in there, fill up our lantern oil, and be like, Fuck you, bird! We'll do it later. We'll do it later. We'll do it later when we need it more. Um, yeah, no, uh, I was going to say, this game is like a weird mix between... Um, the link between worlds and the Ocarina of Time, because obviously it's got the Ocarina of Time feel for it because of the gameplay and everything, hmm. and then it's obviously got the Twilight Realm feel of the Twilight hmm. Realm, which is like the Dark World or whatever. Yeah, well, Zelda games always like they're they're two different worlds, whether it's through time or dimensions or whatever. <laughs> Except Wind Waker. Well, I guess Wind Waker you kind of had the sea as well. Yeah, you kind of had it under the sea. It just wasn't a very uh... very long one. Yeah, just the boss one. Oh, mate, you can't even hit me. I'm too fast. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Wait, wrong game. Sorry. <laughs> God, can you imagine what Gandalf, like Gandalf or whatever Zan, must be thinking right now? Like they're getting killed by a wooden stick. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I'm right, just no. hoping that you can't get a, a better stick. You're doing this in one. Got it. Oh, oh. you got him. You got him all. Great work there. He's staring at me. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. Nice, thank you for doing the monkey voice. No worries. I know you have trouble sometimes doing monkey sound effects. Oh yeah, that's that's one of my uh, 
Secret burdens that I have to live with. Uh, if you hadn't come, Froom, gee, me and that monkey would have gotten eaten, probably. She's actually a pretty nice gal, that monkey. She tried to protect me, so we got captured together. Ooh, yeah. Um, Floomp? You're not gonna mention this to my dad, are you? You've been gone for hours. Do you think he... How does he not know that you're gone? <laughs> He's always telling me to never, ever go into the forest. Because he says it's dangerous. Well, he's obviously right, isn't he? Hmm. It's nice that you decided today of all days just to go in on a whim to chase a monkey. Yeah. <laughs> to chase a monkey. So you can't really tell him. Really, you have to promise. Promise me, Link. <laughs> <laughs> Can I grab oh, who's this? Who's this? Uh, it's, uh, this guy. Oh, Starshio. goodness, I can't even remember <laughs> his voice. Uh, my son told me Tallow had Tallow disappeared into the woods and had not returned. I came as soon as I'd heard. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. I came as soon as I heard. <laughs> but it looks like you have brought him home already. I apologize. Such a task should not fall to you. Tell me, have you noticed how strange this wood seems lately? I feel uneasy about what may lie in wait. Oh, shit, we're rotating around our conversation and everything. Anyway, Floop. It is dynamic. Hmm. I should have kept it going, though. Hmm. Tomorrow is the finally the day you will be departing for Haruli. Hyrule, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get that right. <laughs> I think it is a good thing I have given this task to you. <laughs> good luck, and return safely. He's kind of staring at you a bit weird. I mean, he is quite a weird man. I think we, we've been over this before. Yeah. He is he is the most scary character in this entire game. <laughs> With that, that real, real long Pinocchio nose. <laughs> if you're lucky, you may even get to meet Princess Zelda. <laughs> See, he is just a pervy old man, so... Mm. Except he has a children. He has children and a wife he, he who's has, pregnant. He has a children. A children. One whole children. Oh, oh shit. yeah. Here we are. Why aren't you wrangling those? Why wrangles? aren't you wrangling those rhymes? Oh, who's saying this? Let's Oi, Thwomp! There we go. Wow, that was a very short scene. Yeah. <laughs> so, almost time for you to get going, huh, Thwomp? So, how's about we finish up early today, bud? What do they do here? Just let the ranch let them out and then push them back in again. Yeah, there's not there's not really a lot, is there? No. There's only well, there's only ten when I was doing it as well. It doesn't seem like a big ranch. How are they gonna feed everyone? I guess it's only like ten people in the in the town as well. Hmm. Right, I guess we need our horse, don't we? Ah. Well that's Good why thing we have... this grass right there. Yeah. That was very convenient. <laughs> Schnurple song. I think I feel like Schnurple's just like a bit of a derpy horse. Yeah, pretty much. Like it, it responds to one song. And it's just hey. like ah, I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> okay then, let's get started. Ah oh, shit, now it's my turn to ram wrangle. Oh. And it's gone. Beat oh. my time. Oh wow, oh, there's 20. 20. There's 20. I'm not even sure. Oh, oh geez, it's gonna. It's all right. It's all right, Phil. You I wonder if it were because before we did a bit. Uh, oh, that's a that's a four way. You got a four way. Yeah. Because uh, I'm the ultimate goat herder. Right. If you go around, if you go around the edge, yeah. you get yourself. I, I don't. I do not need your help. I'm gonna hurt him. Come on. No. You, I don't, oh, I don't, you, think, I don't you, think, think you can hurt him into the barn. No, really. <laughs> what a surprise. I oh, see. I'd already have had it done now. Done by now, but I did have training, you know. So. Yes, you did uh, grow up on a virtual farm. Yeah, virtual farm, farming simulator. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Just, oh, no. Oh mate, this no. one. This one's so many. But this one could have. This one could have made it. Made it much more impressive for you. Well, he just kind of ran in. He felt embarrassed that he ruined it. That's because all of his mates had ran in. He felt the peer pressure. All of them are kind of dotted around the outside now. That's why you gotta go around the outside and just hurl, herd them all in. And then you can get, you can get, I bet you can't get a six way for this last one. Oh. 
Go on. You can do I it. I know if you woke them too much, they actually get angry and knock you off. Oh. If you just chase them around like Tony. Why has he gone that Why way? Why did he go that way? Silly Ram. Silly, silly Ram. See, this is why they need wrangling. <laughs> silly Ram. You wonder how that horn grows out of their he head, given that it's joined together. Like, usually the horns, you know, they come out of either side, whereas this one, surely... Either, either they meet at the top, or I don't know. Logistics in this game. It grows like, out of one side, then impales the head on its approach to the other. Oh, that, that'd that be painful. Hmm. That'd be super painful. How, do you know what the time it is for this one? I don't think there is one. I think you just set a time and you can always come back. Oh, okay. oh go it. You... Oh. You stinky ram. Uh, let's see if I can get it really piss it off and get jumped on my horse. Go on. Come here, ram. Attack. I'm not sure if that's a thing that. Yes, yeah, there we go. There we go. Here we are. Oh. Oh, he's. Oh. You didn't avoid him either. Oh, oh shit. he hits you as well. Hit him with your, hit him with your sword. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, that, he gets really oh, angry. Shit. Okay, quick, get back on the horse. Get, back, get on the horse. Get on the horse. Get on the horse. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> now the ram is wrangling you. <laughs> I think he's calmed down now. I think that's the ram. Okay. Yeah. He's finished These lunches last an hour. Yeah. Get in there. I uh. beat you. Nah, that was a terrible time, but I thought I'd show that off. <laughs> yeah. That's fair. Oh boy. But y'all can hurt. That was 49 seconds faster than usual, apparently. Apparently. What do you usually do? Mm. You usually just sit there picking your nose for two minutes and go, Oh, I guess I should ram... ram <laughs> guess ram I should probably it. start wrangling some rams. <laughs> well, today that about wraps up... Wraps her up for today. Yeah. Yeah. So how's about y'all head on over to the mayor's place? Um, well, that wraps up for today, hey, and that yes. also probably wraps up for today for us as well. Yeah, so next time we'll head over to the mayor's place. The mayor we've not met yet. I don't uh, think so, no. We might have seen him wandering around, but we didn't say hello. No. We had other things to be doing. Yeah, we were chasing baskets and pumpkins and whatnot. Yeah, we've right. been having an adventure already, <laughs> and we haven't even left Auden. So until that time, I've been Dill. I've been Phil. And we've we've been DP gaming. Uh, see you next time for more Twilight Princess. <laughs> Yay! I remembered. Bye. Bye. <laughs>